Julian. Welcome back to the channel and welcome to Travel with Julian, Uganda, day number three or four, something like that. I spent the night for my birthday on a gorgeous remote island in the middle of this beautiful lake. I hope you guys enjoyed today's episode. Give this video a big thumbs up and let me know down in the comments below if you would come here if you had a chance to visit Uganda. Good morning. Welcome back to another Travel with Julian, Uganda. I am leaving my room and it's very dark outside so I'm glad that I've been taking pictures as soon as I arrive to my accommodations because we leave so early in the morning that I don't get to see what the outside looks like in the morning because it's dark. So I'm glad I took pictures yesterday. I'm going to head to the dining room, drink some tea. I'm going to go there 15 minutes early uh, for me to go there and start my drink because we're going to meet for breakfast in 15 minutes and then half an hour after eating we are gonna head back on the boat take a half an hour boat ride back to the van and then we are making our next adventure to another national park where i am going to be uh, trekking for chimps and it's not as strenuous as the gorilla trek yesterday um, but i was able to wash my clothes with my bar of soap which note to self i need to bring loose detergent every time i come to africa to wash my clothes because i can't be washing my clothes with my bar of soap but i was able to get the dirt off of my pants i'm wearing it again and i'm just layered up because oh, it's really cold here it was nice and warm and i had a nice comfortable night we are good morning look at this banana with passion fruit and pineapple and Milk tea and more passion fruit. Mmm, yes. the tea is so good right now. <laughs> That's nice. You sleep okay? Yeah. Now I'm fresh. Ready to hit the stone. Okay. <laughs> and here you say you are ready to hit the stone. Mm -hmm. Where I'm from, we say we're ready to hit the road. <laughs> so our roads are full of stones. Stones. Yeah. <laughs> okay, let's try. Let's try this. I added a little sugar. Mmm. Mmm. Wow. Very refreshing. This may be the best passion fruit juice I've had so far Super. in Uganda. Why? Because the others have been so sour. Yeah. Oh, the sun's Toast. coming out. I'll take it. Oh, it's soft. Oh, we love soft Just break. Just had breakfast up there in the dining room and... One last glimpse of the island. It was just me last night with my guide on the oh, whole island. Look at how pretty this place is. So we have about a four or five hour drive to our next destination. Like seriously, how beautiful is this place? The perfect place to spend my birthday remote didn't have any kind of really any reception here no noise just nature but it definitely took us a long time to get here two days worth of driving and a boat ride to get here There's the duck. I guess it's just one duck on the property. Good morning, ducky. Good morning. Wow. 
Good morning. Good morning. How are you? Good. Are you okay? Yeah. Did you miss us? Yeah. <laughs> the best place to spend a birthday in the middle of Uganda. The best. So pretty. Let's see if I can get a video. Are they always here in the morning? Yeah. Oh. You see, when you look at the the, the the national flag. Yes. That is the bird which is there. Oh my gosh! They're showing up for me. They're so pretty. I love them. Let's see if I can get a picture of them on the... Give this video a big thumbs up. Look at this. They're so beautiful. Oh my goodness. I love it. They make such cute noise. Mm -hmm. That was such a good sighting. Water is like glass here. So the lodge has their own private parking. Look at that. And it's gated. So pretty. I love the landscaping. Yay. That was perfect. Goodness. All right, if you guys ever have a chance yeah. to stay in this part of Uganda, the name of the lake, the name of the lake, Bunyonyi. the best lake in Uganda. Yeah. I hope you guys can stay at Heritage because it is really the best. Best place to be remote, far away from any kind of noise except nature, which is my favorite kind of noise. They have their boat. Private boat. Yes. <laughs> it really is the best. And a gated uh, parking, parking. Parking. Yeah. Yay. Take a look. One last look of the lake. It's perfect. Oh, the perfect place, really. And we're off. <laughs> that was so good, that was so perfect.
driving school. I love that. How old do you have to be to be able to drive in Uganda? Starting with 18. 18! In Europe, 16. Yes. Yeah, same like same like the states. Same thing. So when you go here, yes. This side Yes. It's 20, 25 kilometers to the border of Rwanda. Oh, wow. One day I'll go there, but I'm not going to go see the gorillas there. It's too expensive. I told you, and now they're to make it Oh, my gosh. That is gonna wrap up today's video. I hope you enjoyed seeing my adventure of the day. Comment down below what was your favorite part of the day and keep watching because we have a few days left in Uganda until we head to Kenya. If you're new, welcome to the channel. Subscribe for daily uploads between the main channel and the vlog channel. You get a video each and every day. Aloha from beautiful Uganda.